good. Good day to spank Phil Cairns today. <laughs> <Look at that. laughs> it's beautiful. That's rubbish. Well, that'll be OK. No pressure. Oh, oh no. Have you got a chainsaw in that bag? <laughs> so, mate, are you actually playing any golf at the moment? Uh, I haven't played much. I'm looking forward to when my teen, three teenage kids grow up, but uh, no, it hasn't been a lot of time. Lucy'd be 21. 21 now, now yeah. Because yeah. you started young, didn't you? Katrina and I were both 21 and had Lucy, so um, it, you know, it was difficult when you're playing test footy and also you know, changing nappies as well. Oh, look at that. That's on the other fairway. That's the hole we're playing down there. Oh. You did think it was a dog leg, but you were <laughs> right. That's out. For a Queenslander, you're no good in the beach. Oh, oh knees. How are your knees, mate? Uh, not too bad. Yeah, sort of, it's been a while now since we injured that one, but, um, you know, 1994 over in Durban when it happened and, you know, every ligament was gone in the knee. So what did you, what did you think when the doctor said to you, forget about playing again, you won't even run again, just be happy that you can walk? Oh, I just wanted to get back to a normal life. And a normal life to me was walk down the shop, buy a chocolate milk and buy a pie with your daughter, um, rather than getting back on the rugby field. I put so much time and effort uh, off the field with physiotherapy. You know, when I came back uh, and played test footy again after about 15 months, it was a, a new experience for me, and I started to realise then how important it was to um, have that gold jersey on my back. I'll call it double or nothing. Oh. That's nice. That's nice. Ah. Uh, I'll give you that one. You're a great centre. Rubbish golfer. Oh, still got you by four. Well <laughs> done. Thanks, mate. Presented by St. Hallett. Earthy.